Hi everyone, this is Noelle from Scrap Paper Art, and I thought I'd share um, some goodies that I got this weekend. As you can tell from the title, it says My Blessing Haul. Um, I won't do hauls because I don't particularly care to watch them. Um, not that I say I, I won't watch them, but um, I'm more into the creativeness. I don't really necessarily care to see what people buy at Michael's or Joann's and week after week and day after day. I mean, some some channels, that's all there is, is haul, haul, haul. And I, I just, I don't know, I think I'd rather see your creativeness than the money that you spend on stuff that, <laughs> frankly, probably don't even get used. So... But I know that this stuff that I got, I definitely will use this, and some of this I will be gifting, and some of this I will be um, making kits. So with that said, let me show you what I got. Saturday, um, here in a complex, they have a thing called Trash to Treasure, and that's where the people here um, get to sell their things. They don't allow garage sales, individual garage sales. So. Um, once a year, they allow you to, um, they open up the clubhouse and you can buy, a, rent a table. I think it's $3. And then you can bring your stuff and sell it. I went through, didn't find a whole lot, but I did find one lady who had these crocheted pieces. And as it turned out, her mother had crocheted these. And um, I just thought that was very pretty. I've been watching a lot of videos, like I love Maggie White and I love... Um, uh, Scrap and Happy XO, um, Jeanette. I I love what they do with all the doilies and laces and things like that. And I thought this would be pretty for a little book cover or something. And there was, there's two like this, and then there is one large piece. And um, that was only two dollars, so I thought that was a good deal. Then I on Sunday, hubby and I went to a local. Um, swap meat, flea market type thing, and it was just full of um, wonderful finds. Um, the first place that I went, the, um, this gentleman had all this stuff, and this was the very first thing that I asked him um, how much this was. I thought this was very pretty. I don't know if you'll be able to tell in the light, but it's a very light blue, and it has some beautiful sequins on it. Um, so when I asked him how much, he just kept, he goes, well, let me see. And he pulled it off the boat, and he's just measuring and measuring, and I'm counting, and it's like there's 10 yards and for very inexpensive price. And I said, well, I'll take that. And then I spotted this. And I love this blue. I, I don't know if it's a, what they call if it's a cobalt blue or what, but yeah, I thought it was a very different blue with with the little tiny pearl beads on it. Um, I, I just love it. This is it's this is stretchy also. Um, this is also stretchy. Um, so this was very inexpensive. I think it was only a couple of dollars. And then I spotted this and asked him the same thing. And I guess he realized I was a serious buyer, so he just he didn't bother measuring after the first one. He just named a price, and I said, I'll take it. And then there, um, I like this. I like this crocheted. Um, it's white, and I like the layering, which this will allow, you know, you can lay other laces on there and um, you can dye it and that. Well, anyways, I got all that. Then also from him I got this. It's a mauve crocheted, the same as that, only it's in mauve. It was just this piece. I think these were all like 50 cents or something like that. Um, there was this piece. This is a I don't know if you can tell, but it's a it's a it's a light tan, um, and I thought that was very pretty. I'm not sure what I'm going to do with that. I'm not sure if I'm going to. I might find a place on my dresser for it, but anyways, if not, then it'll end up on a book. There's that, and then there was this piece, and I thought, well, I'm not quite sure 
what it is, but I'm sure it's an applique for a dress or something. But um, I thought it would just be very pretty just to cut all these flowers and the leaves out and put them on different pieces in that. I just thought that was very pretty. Um, then I got this little piece of trim. Um, it's very tight, tightly woven. It's nice pink. I like that. Um, this piece, it's nice and, I don't know if you can tell, but it's, um, probably can't see it up against this dark color. It's just a piece of black lace, which I think is very pretty. That I think I'll put on a book, a lace book of some sort. Um, then there is, there's this, which I thought was very pretty too. I can cut that up and use all individual um, flowers in that. Um, then I went to, an. this is all from three vendors, that was it. Um, I went to another vendor um, and I found um, this. It's a real light. Um, almost, it's a brown, it's tan, but it's almost got a, a pinkish hue to it. And um, I think this is six yards for a dollar, something like that. And I, I thought, well, that was very nice. And then um, this piece, which I thought was very nice. Very nice applique, lace applique. Very pretty. And that was very reasonable. Um, and I think, oh no, I got this, I also got this from that one vendor too. This is a cream, um, kind of a doily, I don't know what they call this, but it's the heavier, um, crocheted stuff and I got all that I think there's six yards here and um, so oh and then at the first one I got this piece it was just 50 cents and I thought this was just gorgeous a light blue with all the sequins that would be pretty would that be pretty on a, on a book the front the closure and wrap it around so I got that and then the last uh, vendor I went to, I got all of this stuff. And these were all in... I had tried doing this video yesterday and it just did not turn out. So I took all these apart. These had, these were all in bundles and had rubber bands around them. And I had already taken the rubber bands off. But anyways, I will show you. Um, these two are the same. And isn't that just isn't that so pretty? The the trim on that, isn't that gorgeous? Love that. The dangles, the dangle trim seems to be everyone's favorite. So I got all that, and then I've got I got this. It was it's very delicate, very light, um, lacy trim. So I got all that. And um, I got, I think there's a couple of these. I got this. I thought there was another one, but I guess not. This trim, which I thought was very pretty. Very, very pretty. And then this, uh, this one. It's another um, of that kind of crochet type lace but it's very nice I like the small pieces because they can be layered on top of that's what I'm learning from the ladies that are the experts on this that you uh, layer your laces so I thought that would be pretty and then I got three three of these three, bu three of these bundles and I just thought well, I guess I didn't take those off. Um, the appliques. I think that's the way it goes. But how pretty is that? Individual appliques. And they can be cut up or used all together. Or 
but I have to stretch them out I have to so that they kind of lay flat. They were all in the bundle, but isn't that pretty? Is that gorgeous or what? I'm just so happy. I can't believe all this. And then I got this, which I thought was very pretty also. A nice trim. And then she threw this little... <laughs> she, then I asked her how much this was, and she just gave it to me for free. And I thought that was so sweet of her. Um... Look at that nice little trim. Is that pretty or what? I really like that. And then this lady also had some buttons and some zippers. So I got these zippers. They were, I think, seven for a dollar. But look at the size of that. Is that not perfect for a card or... Um, mixed media or you know just anything but I got it in white she had it in different colors but I got the white because if I wanted to color it up I could or and most of the time if you put it in mixed media you could gesso over it anyhow but I got um, I got 14 of those my husband got he, we actually bought um, 28 he took 7 and I took 7 so I got that and then um I got packed of buttons. These are glass buttons. I don't know if you'll be able to see those with the light. Let me see in the, in the thing if you can see those. Yeah. But those are very nice, pretty brown. And I think her buttons were a dollar a bag. And then I got these these are kind of like they got a it depends on the way the light shines there's purple they come out blue um, can be it almost looks clear but they have gold on it those pretty so I got those and then last were these. They're kind of like a half buckle, but I thought, how pretty are those? On my last one, yes, on the last video I did yesterday, everything out of my mouth was gorgeous. And uh, today everything's pretty. I think I like pretty, as you can tell. So um, I thought these would be nice with a little piece of lace going through it. Well, possibly something like this. Let me see if I can find a trim. Oh, look at all that. Mounds and mounds of mounds and mounds of goodies. Something like this. I don't know. Anyways, you get the idea. But anyways, all of this <laughs> I all right, hold on to your seat. I paid about twenty dollars for everything that I just showed you. So now I think you understand why I said I counted my blessing haul. Anyways, thank you everybody for watching, and please leave a comment. I do enjoy reading your comments, and have a blessed day. Thank you.